My name is Jason Sabota. I'm a urologist here at Virginia Urology and cover all sorts of uh, different urologic care, whether it's prostate enlargement, male sexual dysfunction, uh, different, type of, uh, different types of urologic cancers. My undergraduate was actually in economics and I kind of took a turn when I realized that I had a lot more interest in some of the science electives I was taking. And so I went ahead and did more work there. I ended up having to do a little bit of extra work after undergraduate. And then I was able to get into med school and, and pursue surgery from there. I think a lot of what brought me into wanting to pursue urology was a, a mentor that I had who was really interested in not just um, the, the clinical aspect of urology, but was interested in his approach to education. What drew me to surgery was being able to help patients um, when they were really at their, um, their most vulnerable and being able to help the patients and their families and get them through a difficult time. The urologists also do medicine too. We do a lot of medical care and we treat patients by doing less invasive procedures. So you get a nice blend of taking care of people that can be in really tough spots, or you can see folks that you take care of and you get to have a nice conversation and find out what they're up to and what their children are up to, and it can be a really uh, nice experience for everybody. So I chose Virginia Urology. Um, it, it really worked out well for my family, and I was um, very excited about the way that Virginia Urology approaches patient care, and I knew that I would be comfortable and I would thrive professionally and that makes me um, very comfortable for being able to be there and support my family. Um, I think that the way that we approach patient care is in a, in a very collegial fashion. Um, we, we share patient experiences, we share cases. Um, it doesn't benefit me to um, try to keep patients if I have a specialist or, or uh, a partner who can do the work in, in a, in a uh, more proficient fashion. So the way we approach care here is that we want patients to get the best care and it doesn't um, bother me in any way to refer to one of my partners. In fact, it's something that I appreciate greatly and I know that I can tell a patient that when I, if I can't take care of them because of um, their special disease process that they have and something that I, I just don't feel comfortable managing, I know that I have a partner who can take care of it and who's going to do a great job.